Hey, did you hear about Jimmy Uso's injury? Yeah, but what does that have to do with me? Now his wife Naomi needs a new partner in the Mixed Match Challenge Tournament. As a reminder, the winners get to be co-GMs of SmackDown for one night. So are you interested in taking his place? GM for the night? <laughs> yeah, I'm in. All right, I'll make it official. And you should probably go talk to your new partner when you get a chance. What's up, new partner? <laughs> so you heard, huh? Yep. I was pretty bummed when Jimmy went down, but we can still make the best out of a bad situation. Where are we at in the standings? I haven't been following the Mixed Match Challenge too closely. Seriously? Come on, man! There's no time to play catch-up. The playoffs are about to start, and we gotta face Miz and Maurice. Okay, okay. I got it. You better not screw this up for me. I have big plans for when I'm GM for the night. I want to be GM too, so don't worry. I'll hold up my end of the deal. Now this is an odd couple. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 335 pounds. Dan Fuller and Naomi. I hope she knows what she's gotten into teaming up with him. She's gotten into the beginning of a beautiful relationship, Saxton. Her stock's gone way up just by being in his company. I think she's coming across a turning point in her career. My two favorites are together. tonight you got to believe they were conniving a scheme in the back conniving a scheme you got to stop with these Saturday morning cartoons Saxton it's called coming up with a game plan a plan that can pay big dividends
step in and team together for the first time at this stage, let alone against opponents who know each other so well. Uh, yeah, Miz and Maurice are married, Saxton, so I'd say they know each other very well. It's going to be an uphill battle to defeat them and advance. Yeah. Boom! Face first! He is a sight to behold. Take a picture while you can, everyone. Uh, there's a springboard into a... Oh, no! Crashing hard onto the floor! You have daring, and you have stupid. That was stupid. It was a daring decision that didn't provide the expected result. Yeah, stupid. Good night. Three. Four. A bicycle knee strike. The man is looking a little startled right now. Sidekick finds the mark. Puts in the wrist and the knee to follow. Two. Boom. Head first. Three. Come on, got to get back in the ring. Oh, and back of the elbow. This is getting out of control. The Miz, the Miz has seen better days. Two. He's in, under the ropes. Personified. Punishing their human body. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Miz counters with an attack. Reversal! Can he take advantage? Jeez. Tough spot for the Miz. Reality setting in. Drops the leg. 
You can see her struggling to find her bearings. From the top rope. Oh, and she had Naomi's number. Counters that. She's looking for the win. And Naomi helps lead the team to victory. Dominant forces within their own divisions even more impressive together. Now this is a team I never expected. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 335 pounds. Dan Fuller and Naomi. She may be smiling right now, but I heard she was really disappointed to hear this guy was her teammate. Blatant lies, Saxton, fake news. Who are your sources on that? It's the always focused Paragon Jay Pierce. And from Arlington, Virginia, weighing in at 235 pounds, Paragon Jay Pierce. It must be difficult for Paragon to walk with that gigantic chip on his shoulder. It's good practice for when he starts carrying the men's division. Here we go. Let's see if Paragon can back up his big talk. One of the WWE's grittiest new superstars is Josie Jane. And from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Josie Jane. The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. Josie Jane looks like she's about to bring the pain. It's underway. I'm still somewhat surprised to see Naomi and her replacement partner have advanced this far. They've won one match. Goal. I think their luck ends tonight against Josie Jane and Paragon J. Pierce. Well, I know Jimmy Uso is the home team for the underdogs, and hey, so am I. A Cinderella run like this is what makes tournaments so great. <laughs> Quick thinking from Naomi. Down with the leg drop. Kick. 
Tubbs. Oh, knee right to the jaw. Good night. Counters. Oh, step up in Zagari. Oh, rapid fire. Combo! Ooh, what a full-on club. Oh, look at this. Arm branch. Look out. Enduring some damage. She did her hook work there. Mat slam with some attitude. And now the tag resets the action as the men get set to do battle. Ah, rolling thunder into the face breaker. He gets the tag, and that means his opponent has to switch with his partner, too. And a close line. Big form. Oh, the physicality on the display there. Unbelievable. Down with a leg drop. of strikes just battering their opponent. Close line. What impact. Looking bad for her here. He turns it right around with a counter. Oh, a drop kick. Right on the money. Knew what was coming there. Oh, close line. Women 
have been chomping at the bit, and now they're about to throw down. Kick right on point. She's starting to drag a little bit. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to want scratching and clawing. This could be it. Why? She had it right where she wanted her. She doesn't want the suffering to end, that's why. sure why, but she releases the hold. Well, I think she sets her opponent was about to break free. Big drop of the leg. And the cover for the win! One, two, three! Oh, and she picked up a monumental win! Here are your winners, Dan Fuller and Naomi. And Naomi helps lead the team to victory. That's about as perfect an example of tag team wrestling you're ever likely to see. Oil meets water. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 335 pounds. Dan Fuller and Naomi. You always have to be careful with a pairing like this. You don't really know what level of sportsmanship to expect in the match. Yeah, I've had a bad feeling that he'll be a negative influence on her. I hope I'm wrong. You are looking at one of the most vicious strikers this industry has ever known. He kicks like lightning. Yeah, Shinsuke Nakamura has a bad attitude to match. No, he doesn't. He just doesn't like you, Saxton. And from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the artist known as Shinsuke You know, think about Shinsuke Nakamura, Corey. He just has this relaxed confidence about him. Of course, that's the confidence that comes with knowing you are the king. Welcome, the Empress of Tomorrow. Osaka, Japan, Asuka! Asuka marches to her own drum in life and in the ring. A lethal striker. By the time her opponent knows what hit him, it's too late.
The theatrics of Asuka are just a prelude to an amazing in-ring performance. Asuka, one of the most dangerous individuals in WWE today, and prepared to prove once again that nobody is ready for Asuka. The final match of the Mixed Match Challenge has arrived where Naomi and her partner face a formidable challenge against Asuka and Shinsuke Nakamura. They've been underdogs the entire playoffs and managed to advance this far. I wouldn't count them out here tonight either. I will. No disrespect to the teams they beat to get to the finals, but Asuka and Nakamura are on a whole different level. When this is over, the Empress of Tomorrow and the King of Strong Style will be walking away as co-general managers of SmackDown. Oh, what a kick. Oh, kick connects. Kick lands. Shinsuke Nakamura with a nice reversal. Oh, a front thrust kick. Out of the way in time. Laying in with a shot to the corner. And he's able to counter. He's absorbed some damage already. Sidekick finds the mark. Shots to the body. Heavy hands delivering a succession of strikes. Typical guy hiding behind his woman. Acrobatic action at its absolute best. And Oscar moves. This isn't going to be pretty. Hangman's neck break. Gosh. From the top. Superstar gonna do now. Take a nap. Now this could put you to sleep. Look at this. She releases the hold. That's a little surprising, no? <laughs> Bang! Drop kick. are so important in a match like this, to keep fresh. Russian leg sweep. Nakamura gets the counter. He tags out, which means it's now time for the women to compete. Oh, what a close line. Oscar with a kick downstairs. Not done. Kick out roughly right on top of the action. Keeping a loss at bay for now. Oh, there it is! We could see a tap back. It's locked in. 
Her opponent trying. And she lets her free. But the damage was certainly done, Michael. These guys have been looking to beat each other up for a while, and now it's their chance. That kick drops them to their knees, and now kick after kick after kick. Roundhouse kicks keep coming. The exclamation point, and there's the cover. Kidding me. All turn out the lights just yet. Holding the shoulder hostage now. Slowing them up. Got the head scissors on. Sharp elbow. Scouting pays off against Nakamura. Ooh. Man, what a hit. Get the cover. Oh, look at this. Slapping them around. That's not it. That's got to be it. Two. Well scouted reversal there. him with the counter. Oh, shot to the body. Treating their opponent like a heavy bag. Big uppercut. Setting up. Might just have what it takes to keep Nakamura down. Party's over. Well, they were a patchwork team after Jimmy Uso was injured, but gelled enough to cruise through the playoffs and take tonight's final. Let's not forget what's really important here. The winners of the Mixed Match Challenge get to be GMs of SmackDown for one night. That's quite the reward, assuming it's put to good use. I have no doubt they'll do just that. Congrats again to the winning pair. Well, technically, I did it. Seriously? <laughs> Relax, I'm kidding. We did this as a team. Yeah, we may have been a last minute thrown together pairing, but it worked out okay. So as GM of SmackDown, I know I'm gonna give myself a universal title match against Roman Reigns. But what are you gonna do? Have a glow in the dark match or something? Funny, no. I'm gonna get my SmackDown women's title back. It's been too long since I've held gold. So thanks for helping me make it possible. And good luck against Roman. He's family, but I won't be mad if you're able to beat him. So this is it then, huh? Nah, I'll be seeing you around. Thanks again. I'm gonna go call Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs>